Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Neil Legrandier. I'm the manager of Beyond the Stage and Media Relations here at the Citadel Theatre. I'm with Nicole Diebert, and uh, she is the head of Scenic Paint. And we're going to show you a little bit of a demonstration for uh, what she's doing behind the scenes for Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf. So what are we up to here? What are you working on? Well, I figured I would show you guys um, um, sort of how we get to the process of some of the stuff for the show. Um, in particular, um, the stained glass that we're doing for the show has been a really interesting technique. Um, so just to show you sort of where we start from, is these are the uh, drawings that we get from the designer for the show, and this is how they're presented to us in scale. So then from this, uh, we sort of start making our decisions on what materials we're going to use. So obviously glass is heavy and it's all expensive and stuff, so we were using plexiglass and safer on stage. And then, uh, then we need to figure out how we're going to do the letting for the show. Uh, because of course, if we went real stained glass, it's very expensive. So we got some open cell uh, weather stripping, some closed cell weather stripping, and then we tried different thicknesses as well. So then what we could do from there is, because it already has an adhesive on it, um, you could very simply apply this. And if you make a mistake, you just pull it up. Oh, yeah. Right, so it's very simple, very time effective, and very cost effective mm -hmm. way to get to where we needed to be. From there, we had to create some texture, uh, because we don't want this to just be clear glass. Mm -hmm. We had to emulate some textures uh, that's gonna go inside this area. So then, using um, a gloss gel medium, which is, you get at art supply stores, I would either do, depending on where the designer wants it, um, either you know, a large broad stroke application or a, a very stiffly kind of texture. Right, and is this, is this how you would normally Yes. Execute that. Yes, this is this, this is, is the exactly process. the process that I went through in order to get uh, to the results of our stained glass. So oh, great. this is exactly the um, sample that I showed that Leslie Frankish, our designer, um, and then she could make her decisions from there. Right. And uh, and I'll, I'll hold, hold, hold that. it up so then you can kind of see how the light refracts through the different areas. Oh, yeah. After this, once it gets installed, then we will add some color. To these, uh, to certain parts of this as well, and um, so it'll tie into the set. Perfect. You're working on something else here. Okay, so this so, is the flooring. Is yeah. This? So they, she wants sort of um, a linoleum flooring. Okay. Um, so we're painting this directly onto the stage. And the neat thing with this show is that uh, we do have some pretty cool technology here at the Citadel. We do have some projectors and stuff. So I managed to work with. Um, the audio department, the video department, the stage carpentry department, um, and myself, we all kind of ganged up together to figure out how to best hang the projector and then how to um, modify the uh, shape so that it fit the floor perfectly. So this, so this projected image, it acts as a stencil. Exactly. On the floor for you to paint on. Exactly. Because oh, wow. traditionally what I would do is I would put a nail at every one foot increment around the perimeter here and then I would run string which I would have gridded out and then I would stand above this and slowly draw in where that image would go on the stage. Wow. But because we have the projector I can paint literally to the floor without any of that process and that saves me like two days of work. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for having us and uh, showing us a little bit of what you do here at the Citadel. My pleasure. Thanks, thanks Nicole. So this was a little bit of a sneak peek uh, behind the scenes at the Citadel for Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf, which previews January 23rd and goes until February 13th here on the Shockter stage. Uh, you can get tickets at citadeltheater.com or by calling the box office at 780-425-1820. Thanks very much for joining us. <laughs>